Hello lovelies, you're all welcome to the delicious kitchen. Happy to have you here with me today, lovelies. We are making super goose recipe with African touch. You're going to love it. Let's get it started. In a pot, you're going to pour some vegetable oil, not so much, just a bit of it. Allow it to eat up. After that, add your diced garlic into it. Add your sliced or diced onion. Make sure you saute. Just fry for about two to three minutes. Let it flavor the oil. Let it be caramelized. After that, add sliced or diced bell pepper into it. What I'm doing now is I'm adding seasoning into it yes and I'll be adding thyme black pepper ginger powder salt yes now fry everything together mix them thoroughly and fry openly like this together What I have here is what they call suya pepe. This is where we come to the African touch. Check your Afro shop, you're going to get this. This is going to take the taste to another level. It's going to make it extraordinary flavorful. Pour it into it and give it a thoroughly mix. Fry it more for about two minutes and then keep it aside for later use. So now get your turkey or your goose. I'm using goose, okay? It is this is super well washed already. All you need to get is your kitchen to well to dry it up. That is what I'm doing now. Take your time to do this after cleaning the fourth side, flip it over, and still dry the back of it. After that, I'm going to sprinkle some salt over it. Time. black pepper so it's time to give us a good massage massage it very well feel free to wear your hand gloves but i love to walk direct with my hands like this after working with it then i have to wash my hands with soap all right so now get the baking pan you'll be using i'm using this glass Place it on it and repeat the same process, salt, black pepper and thyme and then massage it very well again. So for the inside, get that our super African touch pepper mix we made at the beginning. Now fill it up with it. After filling it, we're going to place it in an oven 170 to 180 centigrade. We are going to bake it for about two and a half hours hours and after one hours after each hour you open your oven pour some water on it and push it back after two and a half hours this is what you're going to have lovelies this is a must try for everyone let me open it and see what we have here this is super soft super juicy and super tasty a must try for everyone check your afro shop close to you for your soya pepe thanks for watching